What's up, everybody? We are ready to play Connections for Tuesday, January 30th. Uh, so guess what? You'll have the results for today, and you'll have tomorrow's results, and guess what? That will seal up the competition for January, okay? And just give me a few more days, because we have to wait two days just for a few, um, you know, results to still come in, uh, just due to, you know, some time lag. And, uh, and then we will have a uh, video that will show uh, what the places were for everybody who competed in January. And of course, we're going to announce the top four, okay? Uh, I will be included in the results. However, um, I will not be included in the actual standings. I do not participate in getting the prize, okay? So I think it's going to be super exciting. Now, next thing. If under my pinned comment, okay, this is where you need to put it so it's easy for me to find. If you just simply say uh, yes, just type the word yes for uh, if you would like to continue and do a February individual competition, okay, an individual competition immediately rolling into February, just under my pinned comment in this video, guys, just type the word yes. If I see 30 yeses or more, we are going to go straight into February, okay? We're going to go straight into February. And let me just say that, guess what, guys? I think I'm going to upgrade the number of prizes, and um, I think we're going to go for the top 10 people, okay? So the top 10 people will get a prize. That's why I need to have at least 30 people. So that means that you were in the top third by the end of the month, which is really, really impressive, okay? And we may change up the prizes. I think the frosted mugs are pretty sweet. We may give you guys the option to pick which one you want, okay? And I'm exploring a few other possibilities, including some hoodies. If you would love to have a really cool Connections hoodie, then I think we might add that to the playlist. So there you have it, guys. So let's now see if Art can rebound from an absolutely atrocious performance yesterday where I picked up one measly point. It was a fake point, I know, because I got the first two categories in the correct order, and then after that, I completely failed the challenge. Okay, so let's hit play, and um, we'll just scroll down a tiny bit, and here we are on January 30th. This is very exciting. We've got uh, banana, the timer starts now, banana, flower, pound, croissant, hammer, sun, herald, slam, register, feather, star, mushroom, Sickle Moon Bang Chronicle. We've had this before. We've had this before. This is quite a while ago, but I remember you've got the Chronicle, you've got the Star, uh, you've got the Sun, and you've got the Herald. Those are just all names of newspapers. Oh, one away. Um, hmm. Hmm. Interesting. Interesting. Why would it be one away? I mean, the moon? Hmm. Unless it's not newspapers. Like, for instance, Sun, Star, and Herald could be, like, things... Um, hmm. Things that indicate kind of like, uh, like that point in a specific direction or lead you. But if that were the case, I really don't see anything that would act like that. Well, maybe the, possibly the moon. Okay. Um, yeah, I got a little bit, um, a little bit too aggressive there. So let's get rid of those. But I do think we've got something in terms of either leading you by light or possibly um, newspapers. All right. So we've got... Um, you can hammer someone, you can, okay, you can hammer something, you can pound it, you can slam it, and you can bang it. Those would just be to hammer, to pound, to bang, to slam, to make a loud, uh, to make a loud noise. Yeah, that looks like a perfect category. I don't see any crossover with that. What's the right way to articulate this? It's to make a loud noise, to hammer, to pound, to slam, to bang, but basically to, uh, basically to make a loud noise by... Uh, hitting forcefully on a surface. Yeah, hit hard. We, we, we got that. All right. Um, then what else? You've got your... Sickle's interesting. That sort of sticks out. Hmm. Yeah. We've got some imagery here, sickle and the feather, the mushroom, the banana, the moon. Oh, 
Are we back to some flags? I can imagine some flags maybe with some of those on them. Hmm. Yeah. Well, let's try to focus on our green category. I mean, let's let's see what would that be. I mean, um, you've got um, what would where would mushroom go? Mushroom, banana, and croissant. Those are all things that are edible. Nothing else is. Sun, moon, star are all astronomical bodies, but it just doesn't quite follow through. I still feel like it could be that newspaper category. The Herald, the star, the moon. I wonder if it's called the moon. But then chronicle. Hang on. Chron you can chronicle something. You can register something. Nah, that's not quite right. Chronicle. Hmm. That sickle just reminds me of like the uh, former Soviet flag has a sickle on it. Um, oh yeah, it doesn't also have a hammer. So that was probably thrown in there as a little bit of a decoy. Um, I don't know if we really have flags though. Because the best I see that working would be like sickle, star. Well, actually... Sickle, star, moon, and sun. Huh. And flower. Man. Uh, trying to get this green category sorted. I just want to get that out of the way. I think it'll help. Um... Let's just go, ah, shoot. Ah, this is really nerve-wracking. I don't know what to do. Yeah, let's just go with, like, uh, images seen on flags. Not even one away. Okay. Um, should I go with that crazy Mario Kart thing? She's had Mario on there before. I'm pretty sure he threw bananas. I bet there's, some, like, some mushrooms. What do you, I don't know about a croissant. But what else would he throw? Some stars? <laughs> and a flower? Try that. No, this is ridiculous. I just, yeah, I'm just not really playing well anymore, guys. I'm really not. Uh, one guess left. I have no idea what's going on here. I can't even get the green. This is even worse than yesterday. Even worse than yesterday. Um, what the hell could be this green category? I mean, I still feel like maybe we had those... Um, uh, newspapers. Um, so flower wouldn't be there. What's the flower going to go with? I have no idea. What's the croissant? Is there some wordplay? That's one of the few things I'm actually pretty good at. Croissant. No idea, guys. I um, can't figure this out. I'm just going to go with another guess that uh, I think the best chance I have to try to survive would be to pick something involving those newspapers again. So let's see. So I think pretty sure I did Herald, Sun, Moon, and Star. No, no, no. Uh, let's see. We did Herald. Yeah, I know. We did Herald, Sun, Star, and Chronicle. And that was, uh, yeah, that was one away. So, um... So let's maybe get the moon in there. Sounds a little funny. But I wouldn't know what to swap out. Let's go rid of star and put in moon. Moon. 
So I was right about the name. I just didn't get the right thing in there. So it's the register. Crescent-shaped things. Damn it. I was thinking of shapes and colors. I just couldn't make that connection because I kept thinking about the moon as a full moon. Oh, look at that. So that's kind of funny. I actually had all the names. I didn't have crescent shape. Forget that. But I had the newspaper names and power ups and Super Mario World. Oh my God. But I just, you know, I just don't really play it. I only saw one silly video where he was throwing banana peels and that wasn't even the right one. So there you have it, guys. See you tomorrow.